Cam's career is in trouble? I think it is. I think it is. And I take no pleasure in saying that. I wish him nothing but the best. Uh, let, me, let me say this as an aside. Um, I had some business to attend to in Atlanta last week, as y'all well know. Mm. And I went by a nice spot. I didn't realize it was owned by Cam Newton. Oh, really? That's cool. It's sweet. I would strongly, strongly advise anybody that's in Atlanta to go by that spot. It's really, 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 really right. nice. Right by the stadium over there. Nice. Anyway, I digress. My point is this. Cam Newton can play. Cam Newton at 100%. We all recognize the fact that Kyle Allen is not him. But I do think that it's important to recognize the two injuries that Cam Newton has sustained. The shoulder injury, Max, that pretty much compromised and shortened his season last year. And then this year, the foot injury. So one involves throwing the football, the other involves running with the football. And the chances are is that Cam Newton is not going to be the same physically. He's had a lot of attrition kick in, some of the hits that he's taken over the years. Obviously, North Turner, and Ron Rivera has prioritized trying to protect Cam Newton to the best of his ability, to the best of their ability. Cam Newton has been of the mindset that don't take the cape off Superman, man. Let me do what I do. Mm -hmm. But obviously the cape has been taken off because his health has been compromised. And because his health has been compromised and age and attrition has kicked in, in the event that he does not come back and play considerably better than Kyle Allen, reminding us who Cam Newton is, I don't think that will just bring into question his career in Carolina. I think that will bring into question his career anywhere in the National Football League. It doesn't. Max would say Jag, just a guy or just another guy in that sentence. That's what I'm talking about when I'm talking about Cam Newton. I'm not saying in any way he won't have a job. He won't make money. What I'm saying is the Cam Newton that we have revered all of these years, unless he comes back and makes the kind of noise we're capable of, we will have seen the dissipation take place before our very eyes. Let's go back to our original argument, uh, debate about this mm -hmm. when um, the injury forced him out of the lineup, right, uh, off the field. You said, Max, what – because I said, no, his career is not in jeopardy. You said, Max, what if they go undefeated in his absence? Remember that debate? Yeah. And I, and I thought, okay, look, if they go 6-0 and without him, something like that, Kyle Allen's going to keep getting the ball until they lose at least. And if they win most of those games, Cam could be out of a job in Carolina. And what's the, the, the example I always point back to there? Kurt Warner, who still had plenty of football ahead of him, was hurt. Mark Bolger took the job and kept it because they went 8-0, and oh, if memory serves, in his absence, right? So that was that. Kurt Warner still wound up and then made a pit stop in New York while Eli was learning and then wound up taking an Arizona team to the Super Bowl. Here's the question about, you know, for Cam. Can he be basically the same guy he was before the Steelers hurt his shoulder last year? If he can be that guy... Then Stephen A, and I don't see why he can't be. Like, his injuries are not stuff that guys don't ever come back from. What you're talking about is, like, the kind of beating you take can beat the will out of you to play. Mm -hmm. That's what happened to Andrew Luck. Mm -hmm. He just got the fight beaten out of him. Like, he just didn't want to do it to himself anymore. He didn't want to keep running through the brick wall because he had so many injuries. He had so many setbacks. It just, at a certain point, it felt like it was going on forever. That's not Cam. Cam's like, I want to play. So if Cam can come back from a shoulder... Like, basically, it's a bad wheel and a bad arm, right? If you can come back from those two things mm -hmm. physically healthy and this injuries he sustained are not the kind where it's like a ruptured ACL, he's never going to be the same. Or rather, an Achilles, he's never going to be the same. That's not that situation. As long as he can come back, even if the Panthers are winning without him, some other team will give him a starting job. Miami, But yeah, that's what he's I was going to say. Job. With Carolina, what about divide in that locker room, Stephen A.? I mean, even if he does come back and he's healthy, do you feel like they have to There's not gonna be move either. on from him and potentially well, have to go I've somewhere said, As I said that. at the beginning, when he first went down and they started out 0-2, yeah. I said, what if this dude comes in and wins every game? They got a dilemma, and that's exactly what he's done. Complete 65% of his passes. He's thrown seven in the touchdowns, seven touchdowns, not a single interception in four starts for the Carolina Panthers. The way that Cam has been looking compared to him, you might not want to upset this apple cart. Let's also remember this, Max. 
In Cam's career since he arrived in the league in 2011, Cam Newton has been sacked 291 times. Yeah, it's three he's times been, more than been, the next he's, player. He's, it's he's absurd. Been, he's been hit approximately 600 plus times. And that's with him just dropping back to pass. We ain't talking about the running plays. Mm -hmm. The kind of the, I mean, you 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 see that you see how they judge running backs? Oh, when you hit 30, I mean, I mean, it's time to nose dive. Well, what would they be saying about Cam Newton and maybe, because of the and damage if you that value, he's taken? If you look at you him, can't ignore it. If you look at him like a running back and he's been used almost like one at times, maybe yes. it wears him down. But my question to you is, do you think he's had the fight beaten out of him? No, I don't think he had – no, no. Cam got too much heart And do you that. think his injuries are the kind that you can never come back no. from? Well, I don't think so, but I will say this. If you're not running with the football nearly as much as you once did, then I have to lean on your ability to throw the football. And I have told you repeatedly, I have never considered Cam Newton an elite thrower of the football. I consider him an elite athlete, a winner, Why can't he a run? playmaker. And but you have McCaffrey now? Pick your poison. How are you going to defend the, the ground saying, game against I, both those guys because, and Newton through because the Because his air. fragility has kicked in. The kind of punishment he used to be capable of taking, that doesn't appear to be the case anymore. Maybe. And that's my issue. I don't know. Maybe having two quarterbacks could be good problems to have. We shall see. Mm -hmm. Or not. The Eagles came up short in their trip to Dallas last season, but find out which Eagle thinks the cap.